Hey guys, hope you're all doing well. Now for today's video, we've got some really awesome news to go over. Colin Trevorrow has announced that Jurassic World Dominion has officially resumed filming, and the last few weeks of shooting for the movie seems to be going pretty smoothly. So recently, Sam Neill actually released this really cool photograph of himself, Laura Dern, and Jeff Goldblum standing outside of the Richard Attenborough stage at Pinewood Studios. Richard Attenborough, of course, being the incredible late actor who portrayed John Hammond in both Jurassic Park and The Lost World in the 1990s. It's also one of the first times that we've gotten to see all three of these cast members together in a promotional photo for the next Jurassic movie. Now, with this image, Sam Neill tells us that they're all thinking of their old Jurassic Park colleague, while all three of them will be joined by Bryce Dallas Howard, Isabella Sermon, and Chris Pratt to quote, face our greatest dinosaur terror yet. So this is a quote that I actually haven't seen a lot of people talking about, and I think that may be due to the fact that the actual coolness of the photo itself sort of supersedes any sort of caption that could go along with it. But I do think that Sam Neill's description of all of these characters facing something like that together in the next movie is a really interesting concept. Essentially, what he's saying here lightly is that Alan Grant, Owen Grady, Ian Malcolm, Claire Deering, Maisie Lockwood, and Ellie Sattler are all working together on the Attenborough stage that day to film scenes going up against a wild dinosaur attack, which is basically the entire gambit of major Jurassic Park protagonists working in a specific scene that really sounds like it will be important for the movie. Of course, since all we really have to go off of is the simple caption on Sam Neill's photo, I don't want to read into it too much because we really don't know what he's referencing at all at the end of the day. However, I do think that it's a pretty awesome little nugget of information to think about while we're all still waiting for this movie. Now, with the release of this photograph came the announcement that Colin Trevorrow had resumed major film on the movie and that they were now all back to work like they normally would be. That being said, there's actually been word from the website Variety that Jurassic World Dominion never really stopped production completely since key cast members were actually filming secondary sequences during this hiatus, which lines up with the previous information that we got where it was revealed that a lot of visual effects work was actually still being worked on while the movie was first shut down during filming back in February. So they've really been working around the clock to finish Jurassic World Dominion no matter what during this entire pandemic. Now, main story sequences actually resumed filming last Friday, and with only a few weeks left on the schedule for the actual shoot, I think we can expect Jurassic World Dominion to finally wrap principal photography within the next month or so. That is, God willing, everything goes to plan within that allotted amount of time. Jurassic World Dominion has, of course, also been pushed back an additional year, so with that large amount of time in between now and the film's actual release, I'm not so sure what we can expect to see from Colin or anybody else in that time, but hopefully they'll give us little pieces of info and images that they're working on to help ease that extended wait that we're all going to be going through. Anyways guys, I'm curious to hear what all of you think about this information. What are your thoughts on the work that Sam Neill described the actors to be going through in this recent post, and what do you think about that image in particular? I think it's one of the coolest things I've seen come out of the production for me personally as a fan, but hey, whatever your own thoughts and opinions happen to be, I'd love to hear them in the comments down below. Now before I go, I'd like to thank all of my game wardens, as well as all of my engine executives. I'd also like to thank all of my park workers and engine hunters as well. Guys, it seriously means the world to me that all of you continue to support what I do, and I never want you to ever forget that. Now, I'd like to thank all of you for watching today's video and hope that you all enjoyed the content. If you feel like I deserve it, I'd appreciate the like and hope that you'll consider subscribing if you're interested in hearing from me again. I'll see you all in the next video, guys, and as always, take it easy.